وفر علينا لانه كثير برد بكاسين وبعدين اذا ما نروح نجيب حطب بنتعب كثير بالحرج فبنوصل على المعمل تبع بكاسين مش الحطبات وبنجي شعوري كثير منيح لانه فتح فرص عمل كبيره لاولاد الضيعه جيراني مثلا اولاد جيراني صاروا عم يشتغلوا فيه اولاد اصحابي عم يشتغلوا فيه وجبلتهم جوزي كمان عم يشتغل بالمعمل كان مهم للبلديه انه تفوت بهذا بهذا المشروع لحتى تحمي اكبر حرش سنوبر بالشرق الاوسط اللي هو حرش بكاسين من الحرائق فبيقوموا بتشحيل بتشحيل الاحطاب اليابسه اللي هي منا بقى لازمه للشجره بيرجعوا بيستعملوها بهذا المعمل نحن كلنا ربينا بهالحرش واولادنا كمان نتمنى انه يربوا اولاد اولادنا في الحرش ويلاقوا ضلعه طول نظيف واكيد باهميه المعمل الموجود بمنطقه بكاسين This country did not uh, produce briquettes and so when we tested the provision of briquettes to the poorest community that relied on heat uh, stoves to warm up during the winter, uh, we need to bring them from abroad. But then we started to develop the production of briquettes in, in Lebanon, which means sustainable forest management, means no illegal cutting of, of trees. So this project has an impact from the top level of strategic policy down to the level of, of single houses. And that's exactly where UNDP has a match with our objectives in terms of what we like to do here. Renewable energy, like we do here in Lebanon, is something that's very much in Europe's interest. This project has helped to assist the Ministry in achieving many of the steps that were set forth to achieve our main goal, namely achieving 12% of our energy mix to be based on renewable energies. Lebanon really could become a hub for green jobs, which are the jobs of the future. When you develop new skills, introduce new technologies, uh, you protect the environment, and at the same time you're promoting economic growth, you, you attack multiple goals at the same time. <laughs>